guys and welcome back to my channel happy vlogmas day 12 is that gonna go up like 21 anyway it is vlogmas day 12 and for today's video I decided to share with you guys a hair tutorial I have not done one in a while but they are normally one of my favorite things to do and I was sitting in bed and thinking like what am I gonna do tomorrow I really don't have much going on to vlog and then I was like duh holiday parties are coming up I'm pretty sure a couple people have already had them but holiday parties ugly sweater parties pajama parties Christmas New Year's all these different things are coming up so I decided to share with you guys a hairstyle that I did actually back in October and I had planned to film it then and life happened so I'm filming it now but it's this hairstyle that I'm rocking right now um, I absolutely adore it I think it's very beautiful very simple and very elegant and what better time of the year to do this hairstyle than the holiday season so I'm going to show you guys exactly how I do it and of course you don't have to do it exactly like me you can make it to your own style so I'm going to show you guys how I got it done and you guys can rock this for the holidays. Okay so I already had to throw the towel on because my hair is dripping but what you're going to need for this hairstyle you're going to need some hair cream it doesn't have to be this one specifically whatever you use for your hair you're definitely going to need some gel a brush a comb, your baby hair brush or toothbrush, some clips to hold your hair in place as you style your hair, some hair ties, and some bobby pins. Now depending on how you're going to make this your own, you may also need a soft bun if you're doing a bun. So the first thing I like to do is I like to put hair cream in my hair. Um, I'm not going to go and section my hair and apply it roughly but I am going to put a barrier in between my hair and the gel just to keep my hair nice and healthy. So now that I have applied the hair cream to my hair I'm going to go ahead grab my comb and part my hair. Now you're going to part it as if you're doing um, a side part so whichever side is your side I normally part on the left side with the hair going to the right but you could also do it to the left whichever one is your style now you're gonna go ahead and just clip off the back section of your hair we're gonna do that last okay. so you have your hair in the front and this hair clipped in the back out of the way. Now you're going to go ahead and introduce the gel. You're going to apply to the front, up top over here, and a little bit in the back. Now go ahead and grab your brush and you're going to brush everywhere you applied the gel. So over here, back here a little bit, and of course the front. Now this is where you can go ahead and make it your own. I personally I'm going to braid this part of my hair. Now if you don't know how to braid or you don't want to go with the braid you can always do like a twisty or maybe flip it and do it your own way. But remember we're not doing it down if we're doing a twist or a braid or whatever you decide to do you're bringing it back you're really accentuating the face with this hairstyle and nothing is going to take nothing back here is supposed to take from what's going on over here is done you're gonna get started on the back of your hair we're not pulling the hair to the back we're gonna pull it to the side to meet with the braid so I went ahead and braided it all the way because whether you're going to do a sock bun or a ponytail or whatever you want to do on the side I like to wrap the braid around it just to secure it and really make sure the braid looks nice neat and tight so we're gonna go back into our gel and just gel the rest of our hair and brush it into a side ponytail sock bun 
done, so I'm gonna go ahead and do that. Now once I have this all situated, I'm going to grab the braid, wrap it around the bun, and I'm going to secure it with some bobby pins. Now at this point, you can add hair jewelry if you'd like, or I don't know, maybe some flowers or whatever. I'm going to leave mine plain and I'm going to go ahead and touch up my baby hairs. I'm going to bring out two little curls here on the end. I think it's a nice touch when your hair is nice and slicked back to pull out those curls to give it a more easy flowing look. So I'm going to go ahead with my handy dandy toothbrush and my gel and do my baby hairs. <laughs> you get this up you guys super easy super simple and might I say super beautiful when I wore it in October I got a lot of compliments so I think I might actually even rock this for Christmas myself so we'll see we'll see but um, if you like this video guys don't forget to give it a thumbs up subscribe to my channel so you don't miss a beat and I'll see you guys tomorrow bye